Good morning, everyone. This is Prem's crypto market update for April 28, 2019. If we look at the coin market cap, 1 billion has come in. If we look at the top 10, we can see lightly everything up. Um, Bitcoin doing around 5,200 right now, 5,276 at coin market cap, but at Bitstamp, it's doing 5,167, which is $100 lower. So we say about $5,200. If you look at the top 10, uh, there's not much change, basically. Um, you know, uh, it is 1% or 2% up. Um, hardly anything up, actually. Now, the coins which have done very well are ODEM, uh, up 21%, Loom Network, 12%, Basic Attention Token, 12% up, and Dent, 11%. Coins which have not done that well are Maximine Coin, 8% down, DigiJX DAO, 5% down, Wax, 4% down. Now let's have a look at the charts basically so we can see basically that yeah another doji is in the making uh, i don't know what to make of it stochastics are showing we are going more downwards so let's see how this is going to roll in the coming days now the news comes from finland finland begins regulating crypto service providers so finland's president has approved a law to regulate cryptocurrency uh, service providers including exchanges custodian wallet providers and issuers of cryptocurrency the law will enter next week and crypto service providers will need to register with the fsa uh, out up in there in finland i think wonderful news finland was one of those countries basically uh, which has been holding back on uh, doing something with cryptocurrency and they coming right now into the spotlight so the next news comes from China. So China government develops a uh, development of blockchain city in Malaysia. So the, the Chinese government is supporting a construction of a blockchain city uh, called Malacca Straits City, uh, which is basically in uh, um, the, the shipping lane of the Malaysian Malacca Strait. So um, this is really wonderful uh, to see that uh, uh, Malaysia is taking such a big hand. And more importantly, they are raising around $120 million to uh, start this work, um, and which is going to be a Chinese government-backed project, uh, at, as it seems to be right now. Then the last news comes from Russia. Russia prepares to test cryptocurrency in four of its regions. The Russian Federation, which regulates uh, the digital assets is now planning to allow uh, four of its regions to test uh, 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 innovations that are not covered by its current legislation. A bill drafted by the Economy Ministry um, that establish of regulatory sandboxes has said that the special economic zone will allow companies, entrepreneurs and uh, to experiment with cryptocurrencies without breaking the federal law. It's basically a sandbox which uh, Russia is creating. I think it's wonderful news to see that a Russian, a Russian Federation is taking such steps to look into it. All right, this was the news for today. I hope you like it. Please like and subscribe. Go to our website, bitcoinmagazine.nl, and I hope to see you on the next one.